Hey there, this is Brother Moe from the Active Trapping Outdoor Channel. Today we're going to take an old boat trailer that I picked up and modified to fit our kayaks. The trailer is 19 feet long from nose to tail. So stay with me and I'll take you through the process. I picked up this old boat trailer for a few bucks. It was completely disassembled. The axle was laying on top of it when I brought it home. I took a wire brush grinder and wire brushed the entire frame. I went through two wire brushes, in fact, on my little four inch grinder. It turned out to be just a little bigger project than what I originally anticipated. After I got the frame as clean as I could with the wire brush grinder, I cleaned the frame off and painted it with Rust-Oleum Ultra Cover Primer and Rust-Oleum Painter's Touch Ultra Cover Gloss Real Orange. I cleaned up the springs and the axle, painted them all black, which proved to be in vain, which I will share with you a little bit later. I picked up some Unistrut from the electrical supply store uh, that I would mount my PVC pipe runners on for my kayaks.
I told you cleaning the axle and the springs would turn out to be in vain, and it was. The axle that came with the trailer was four lug on four and a quarter inch centers. You can't find wheels for a four lug four and a quarter inch centers, nor could I find bearings to fit the axle. So I wound up having to buy a new axle and it came fully equipped with the springs and the plates and everything I needed to mount it. So I just had to pull this axle off and put the new one on. I built my tree to add two more kayaks and I'm mounting those to the two center struts of the trailer. I mounted the tree with bolts so that I could take it off if I ever wanted to. I had to put a final coat on my trailer because I still had some primer showing through. This is some aluminum tread plate that I got from my brother. I cut it using a skill saw, very slowly of course. Uh, I riveted it to the top steps. This is 3 inch scheduled 40 PVC pipe that I use for the runners to set on top of the unistrut. I mounted them down using bolts and the nuts that are made for unistrut.
I set my kayak on top of the PVC pipes to adjust the inner PVC pipe so that I'd make sure to get the right distance. My wife has a Jackson Tripper 12, which is exactly the same hole as my Kilroy, uh, so therefore I'm making both sides exactly the same. I'm using the same tread plate that I used to make the steps on the trailer to make fenders. I ripped the tread plate with a skill saw then smooth the edges down with a tiger disc on my four inch grinder. I added LED brake lights to the trailer. Then I added a trailer dolly to the tongue. Well, the only thing left to do is take them to the water. Don't forget, click on the like and subscribe button up here in the left hand corner. Thanks for watching.